Labor Union at the Federal College of Technology, ACOCA, which consists of the Colleges of Education, Academic Staff Union, Senior Staff Union of Colleges of Education, and the Non-Academic Staff Union. Explain why they have decided to embark on an indefinite strike. We have been vote our promotional areas since October 2013 to date, summing up to 16 months. We are also demanding for incremental areas that have been paid us since October 2013 up to date. Other schools have paid. Our emergency government has not released money. So we are in this medium to cry out to the government that if they have not released money since 2013 for white treatment, that they should do so. Then the magnet should also look inwards and find a way to offset that pay. And also tell government that it should always make budgets for increment of promotion yearly. And also, we also have the issue of migration. We have written the management on several locations in this respect. The national body of our union have written them no response. And on our findings, we investigated and we discovered that only Federal College of Education Technical, ACOCA, has not paid that money. Even 2014 promotion is yet to be done. While the protest was ongoing, the provost of the institution was cited trying to break the reserve of the unions. When TVC News tried to get his reaction to the development, this is what he said. It will be recalled that Coesu's national chapter embarked on an indefinite strike last year, but after it signed a memorandum of understanding with the education minister, it decided to return to work. It is hoped that this particular strike will not last for too long. Sharon Ichason, TVC News, Nigeria, Lagos.